the fully, uh, fully still fully on IE with the color failure of the Senta. Uh, around 1 a.m. siya nandun lang. Tapos nag... Uh, parang quite gusto siya naman. Tapos parang may, the plan is for emergency CSA. Hot pot in the call room. We have some inoki! Gulay! Ito, may asado feeling pork balls. Syrup yarn. Bye! I didn't get the chicken. Wow. <laughs> Mama and yeah. the gin the gin the gin the gin Wearing my shoes for today and my co <laughs> coral na white coat. And these are my co residents. Nakakatawain nilagay ko pang buntis ata to. May butas. <laughs> may butas na nga. May butas pa yung ano. Awan ko mali ata. Ito na tayo mga condemned na mga ano yung napuha ko. <laughs> Tapos ito, ito, yung hindi condemned, maganda, di ba? Ito yung small room tour dito. At ito si Princess Mikai with a crown. Ito yung stat ko, iniiwan ko lang kasi lagi ko naiwan sa bahay. Tapos ito ay aking mga cutesy na mga batches during my wedding day. Huwag mapansinin yung nasa gilid. Laptop ni Miss Annie. <laughs> and um, our other seating arrangement, Mrs. Sayo and Mr. Andeng. Okay. And this is our charging corner. Very helpful. Diba? Among telephone. We have an aircon na tumutulo minsan, but that's okay. It's working. That's me! Okay. Inom na ng coffee para magising. Or nagising ako dito. Bye! We are back to the gym lights. And we're going up to the third floor. That's the gym. Wearing a pink top and everything. Gym is done. Oh my god, I'm going to go. I'm going to try to get the power, guys. I'm going to get the power to walk. Oh, well, well.
This is lunch. Fried chicken, half fries, Twix, and salted caramel. And one of my favorites, which is the right and light lemon, of course, water. My water. And we're going home. Yay! And daddy got some lapas, pasoy. Okay. What? Oh, we got some confit, we got some piaya, <laughs> super in it. <laughs> Napasok si daddy. Super in it, piaya. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna manukan grill. Hindi nga, pala, bakulo din na. Baguhin, baguhin, to, you know? Ako naglapas, pasoy, ubos na. Ubos ko ba doon? Ubos ko ba doon? piaya ko na. Gili siya ni Peace. Ginit? Ginit. 10 out of 10. Okay, they're going back home. Love you. Okay, po. Good night. 2 a.m. na kasi kaya ganito. Love you. Sleep. I'm home. That was probably one of the most exhausting and at the same time I had like so many emotions coming from that duty. That's probably one of the, like, the toughest duties that I've had. Well, I won't go into detail anymore, but mostly it was kind of like a misunderstanding, etc. For another service. But anyway, there are really times like that na you know, you get to kind of like have so many emotions and you just cry out. And that's where I usually kind of like go into like cry it out in the bathroom and pretend like nothing happened once I get out. When you go through residency or in my case we have like rotations so it does change every month it's not the same rotation every month so during my first years it was always um, wards in the NICU. I remember my very first rotation being NICU so I was uh, a junior resident in the NICU and I was like a baby I was like a first year baby and then most of my rotations in first year was just alternating NICU and then I go into the wards and on top of that aside from the wards you also do have like some form of like subspecialty wards so I did cardio, neuro and um, hema onco for um, three different months. The schedule, it's also different per rotation. So for my second year, my rotations were a lot different. It was mostly on or around like the crit areas. So my first rotation for January was actually as a catcher. Basically, most of the videos, I guess, <laughs> you guys have seen much of it was when I was a catcher. So part of being a pediatric resident is also catching babies and that's what you're gonna do when you become a pediatrician, you catch babies. Once the OB you know, gets a baby from the mother, they hand it over to you and yeah, you take care of the baby. If there are needs for resuscitation, et cetera, you handle it. For my second month, I actually did start already with my other crit rotations that, that was like the ER, to be honest, the ER was where I really, really learned so much, like exponential. Working in a tertiary hospital, there are so many different cases that you see. And in the ER, kasi first touch ka, so you kind of see the patients firsthand. You get to like assess them firsthand, like do your workup firsthand. And I feel like I get to take it more with me because in the ER, it's just, it's also like gen peds and like neonates. Everything is there, like legit everything is there. And I feel like that's where I really, really, really learned a lot, I would say. So in ER, we have 12-hour um, rotations. So that's ER in the mornings, that's e AM, PM, and off. So we have 12 hours, but those 12 hours are really, really, like, toxic. For catcher, we have, like, duties every four days. And usually when you're the one on duty, you catch the babies. If you're not on duty, if, like, you're pre-duty or post-duty, you do handle DRI. So usually if you're post-duty, you go home by 12 noon. Other rotations I had was like the PICU. So the PICU is a protect ICU. I also learned a lot in PICU. Um, I learned so much from the fellows and the consultants. It's really different when you handle these cases. So yeah, those are my rotations in second year. Um, it's really just the crit areas. ER, PICU, 
um, catcher ship. That's where it like, like goes around and yeah, that is a little glimpse of how life is as a resident doctor. And a lot of you have guys have been asking me in terms of my schedule, so there's that. <laughs> I have also been studying a lot, and we do have exams as well in residency. So I want to take this time to thank our sponsor for today, Lecturio. So I have been using Lecturio for actually a very long time now. Lecturio is a platform for medical students, um, health allied professionals, and even doctors to actually help them in studying and learn more about medical concepts. With Lecturio, I have used it when I was preparing for the medical board exam. And up until now, even as I go through residency, there are still some concepts that um, I have a hard time understanding. So with the help of Lecturio, with the videos that Lecturio has, and on top of that, the quizzes that they have, the number of quizzes that they have, the bank of questions, it helps me understand concepts more and at the same time helps me with spaced repetition. Spaced repetition helps you know what you need to repeat and help you remember so that you're able to retain the needed information better and improve your ability to recall key concepts. Whether you're studying for the USMLE, the Physician Licensure Exam, or any other exam in your medical career, Lecturer can help you learn better. And for Doctors Week, it is 50% off on all medical plans. Let's celebrate doctors and check out the link in my bio to get the best plans from Lecturio. Let's get to the rest of the video. super cute Christmas tree in our call room. Look at that with our photos from our bat. We just did it on our own to make it cute. <laughs> you know what? We brought together images of our customers taken at our Uniqlo Holiday Nook located at our global flagship store. Very funny. <laughs> wow. Oh, oh later, pa. 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 Later, pa.
Pasan na si Pico. Pico. Pico, go to the water. Okay. Wee. Mas scared kaya siya. Swim. Swim. Swimming. Pico, swim. Wee. Not only na much. Second year, guys. 